Okay, the continued adventures with this little Donda E-Mac, whatever it is. Honda XL125 pretend to go like the Mac T7 or something. Anyway, so it's been a while since we last talked about this little bike. And since we've talked, I've done my 4000 mile service. And, yeah, that's a lie. I'm talking about it. I've done my 2500 mile service. And um, all is good. So after our last little video, a couple of things happened. So, I think then this before this fell off, which is what holds this cable away from everything, just fell off in its own accord. This, while oh, holding on the fuel tank, fell off, disappeared, never to be seen again, just one day. And uh, the engine developed a fuel leak of its own accord, um, which I got sorted out at the next service, but it's not really the kind of thing you're expecting from a bike with only 2,500 miles on it, 2,500 kilometres on the clock. Um, now we are, let's have a look actually, I don't know what we're on, the kilometre which we're on. So, Two thousand nine hundred and fifty-four kilometres. So, engine-wise, she's definitely loosened up a lot. Um, I've seen on the on the clock an indicator of one hundred and twenty-nine for a very brief second. Um, I regularly see an indicator of one hundred and twenty, but we have to bear in mind that the speedometer is a piece of crap, and it's between fifteen and twenty kilometres fast. So, in actual fact. Maybe I'm hitting 100 kilometers an hour. Which, if you think about it, the factory top speed is 95, so I'm kind of ahead of the game. Now, my journey to work is about 20, 25 kilometers. And I have to say, I sort of take the engine as a basis. This poor thing has ridden pretty much full throttle for 80, 90% of that journey. Um, over the road to draw, over the potholes and everything. Um, the engine just keeps on rolling. I mean, uh, you know, it's not powerful, and every bit used to be powerful. But it's got character. The noise is nice. The noise in the um, obviously aftermarket, of course. selling her soon and trying to be selling her soon. Um, nothing really wrong with the bike from what's not a seller other than um, I'm also selling my bigger bike, my Durago 535. And I want to get rid of both of them and get myself a Motard. Probably an MLE Motard, MLE 200, um, XTMR. Or if I can't get the MLE I'm looking for, I might go for the NASA N5, which I'm aware isn't a motor, it's a naked 250 single. But I just need that little bit more power um, that this thing doesn't give me. And I also need a bigger bike, I look ridiculous on it, I'm a fat white bloke. And this is a tiny little bike. But maybe night nice, is cute, and I tell you now, it is a lot of fun to ride. A lot of fun to ride, so it will be probably being sold. Oh, well, I say sold, I'll probably. Um, Do it part exchange as a deposit for the bike, the next bike. But we'll see, you know, if these things happen. I've put the big bike up before and never sold it, changed my mind. 